As if our state's biggest rivalry isn't already enough, this year's edition of the State U football game has possibly never had higher stakes in the series history for both teams as they're in the mix for a playoff bid. The Jacks are playing for home field in the FCS playoffs. Those host Coyotes, they need to win their final two just to make the playoffs. Let's get it going. First quarter in Vermillion. Ryan Sager airing it out and Brand Van Ruckel on the receiving end. 40 yard touchdown, USD is up seven to nothing. Now the Jacks get a field goal in the second and they take the lead going into the half on Taryn Christian's 10 yard touchdown run. Bit of a rough day for the freshman though, it's still 10-7 stayed at half. Third quarter belongs to USD. Sager with a one yard sneak, they're up 14 to 10. On the next possession, I told you Taryn Christian had a bit of a rough day. Well, here's an example, he's picked off by his former Roosevelt teammate John Wessel. They would pull Christian after the third. State trailed 20 to 10 going to the fourth quarter, but they would put Zach Lujan in, that changes things. The passing game got going, Kyle Paris got going as well on the ground. That's his second touchdown run, State's up 24-20. USD trying to answer on their next possession. Sager makes a big mistake, Nick Farina picks it off. And he houses it, and that's going to house USD. Same thing happened two years ago. State got a pick six late to salt it away. This one a little bit closer. SDSU wins 30-23. Coach Stiglmeyer afterwards, all the respect for Glenn and his Coyotes. He's taken a, a program and, and changed, changed it. And I know this was a tough loss for him because of his investment in Coyote football. Uh, it's equally as great a victory for the Jackrabbits. But uh, we beat a good football team today and uh, I'm proud of our guys.